Hello pack members, it's your girl Alpha Wolf here, and today I am playing What Never Was. So this is a free game that I found on Steam. Um, it just looked interesting. It said partial control for a controller, but I'm not sure what that means. Um, It does seem to be that I can use my controller, but right now I have to use my mouse to get through the menu. Um, back. Actually, let's go back here. Audio. I like to turn the music on these things down. Just so I can hear the voices and stuff. Otherwise, it just ruins a good game. Hey mom, where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but mom, don't we owe it to grandpa to... Yeah, I know, it's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Okay, okay, whatever, it's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then, I don't know, we can come back tomorrow and do the rest. Yeah. Bye. I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. All right. Let's do this. Right, why is it my... Just a second. I'm having a little trouble with my controller. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess I'm doing WAZ then. Uh, Alright, so the reason I got this is because I can understand what it's like going through somebody's things. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. Some objects are worth inspecting more than once. That helpful, I guess. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. Right button to interact. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. Pretty countryside. Ah, the old gramophone. I used to put this on for Grandpa after dinner, and we'd sit and listen to it together. I've never been much into swing music, but it was our little tradition. The old yeah, enough of that. Okay, so... Alright, so we can crouch. A desk drawer. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Not locked. An open desk drawer. It's locked. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. I just wasn't sure if there was anything else that she was going to say. A desk drawer. Oh, I got something. Picked up a journal page. Um, Q. Elfenstein, also known as some, also sometimes known as 
troll stones, the subject of Scandinavian folklore, normal rocks with holes in them the size of an acorn. Considered lucky, otherworldly, and useful, hung from the necks of livestock, it protect their, them and their farmers alike from miscellaneous predators, trolls, and even inc incubi. In some tales, the owner of a true Elfenstein was also able to see the otherwise invisible common troll through the hole of the rock. While several of these were on display, only one looked to be the one I was looking for. I carved in a way that no average jeweler could look for. Carved in a way that no average jeweler could and with or in place of where the hole should be. I didn't acquire it through most honest means, but no one came to harm, and I'm sure its disappearance won't be noticed. I do wonder how now do wonder how it fits into all of this though. Necklace I got from grandpa, her student ID, and her phone. Okay. She has nothing to say about that? A desk drawer. Nothing in it. It's a banker's lamp. Alright, simple enough. Oh hey, here's another page. A torn out page. Torn out page two. Seems no coincidence that both resting places of peel and da 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 be happy da da da. I can't read these things! Okay, if y'all want to read it, pause here, because I, I am horrible at reading out loud. I'm sorry. Okay. Onward. A tape recorder. Hello. This is Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can start off immediately, please. <laughs> <clears throat> Sarah, if you are listening to this, then it means, well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I, I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother. But I think I'm there were good reasons. Me. There are things in this world greater than ourselves, and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to. I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it, it's unavoidable. Pixie, I need your help. But I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. In every breath of wind and every dancing flame. All you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. Alright, so I didn't end the game. Goodbye, Grandpa. So, I do honestly know how she feels. Um, I was really connected to my grandfather. Uh, he was my best friend and the only person that I could really talk to. 
Does this globe have anything to do with Grandpa's message? What did the message say again? The world is from the tallest tree to the deepest river. Shoe, Egypt, and a symbol of a... Oh, okay. These can be in every breath of wind and every dancing flame. Could he be referring to these symbols? That must be a river. Swirl must be air. And then... That must be yeah. <laughs> I did it! This looks like... Is this a second part of my necklace? Five, so there's more pages that I may have missed. say about the old typewriter. That's obviously a crate. Just kind of going around looking at things. So let's just look and uh, V to look through the necklace. Okay. Serious woe. It's a small key. I'm guessing it's to the desk. Oof. That was trippy. But enjoyable. A little mildly terrifying though. I don't know why, I just get spooked really easily with games like this. It's like, okay. It's locked. Huh. This tin box looks fairly old and has a combination lock on it. Okay, 
so now we can zoom. Does combination be my name? Um. Combination B. H. Damn, I was sure that would be it. Maybe I need something else to solve this. Well, boop. I was kind of hoping it'd be that easy. Each one has a symbol. Let's write letters up. Pixie. P I X. So I get my mouse working, working again. I. pages again, starting with one, and um, I got my notebook right here, okay. Ah, I just hit my mic. Hello. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so, as soon as the page rotates around again, fire is just a triangle. for the water droplet? Upside down triangle, so W upside down tree So I'm trying with a line through it. <clears throat> That's the right side up triangle. With a line through it, which I'm going to guess is air. Hi socks, how are you? Yeah. Alright. So now we're gonna look through the freaking thing again. teleported what just happened that was the first time I traveled by magic pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries I so wish he told me sooner 
so we could have gone on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure, the one that never was. But that is a longer story for another time. Alright, so that was what never was. Um, to be perfectly honest with you, I would like to see like a full-fledged game from this. Um, you know, maybe a, uh, a full story. What happens after she goes to the clock? Um, you know, what adventure did she go on? What happened? Did her grandfather actually die or did he get lost in, you know, whatever way, shape, or form? Other than that, I enjoyed it. Like, it gave me a... Spiderwick Chronicles slash... I don't know, I want to say Narnia vibe type deal. I enjoyed it. The graphics were great. The story was great. Um, did have a little trouble with that clock, but that's just my own stupidity. That's user error. Uh, but yeah, it was a great story, and um, I hope sometime in the future this concept gets taken further to a full-fledged play, 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 full-fledged game. But other than that, I enjoyed it. So, good work. Good job. Anyway, if you guys liked the video, be sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Be sure to give that notification bell a high five so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!